That thing will level the entire city just to get to us. Come on, we have to take it out. I'll cover you from the air. You just find a way to stall it. Stall it? It's the size of a building! How do I get myself into these situations? Oh, if I know, Ratchet. Anyway, guys, welcome back to Ratchet and Clank Kraken Time. Last time, we infiltrated Pollux Industries. Uh, Dr. Nefarious found out about it and sent this freaking uh, VX-99 to go and destroy our freaking ass. This guy has a, has a revenge out against uh, Ratchet, if you haven't noticed. And this is basically coming from uh, Ratchet. Ratchet and Clank 3 Size Matters, I believe. I think that was the last game that had, uh, holy crap, laser beams. That had, or the first game that had Dr. Nefarious in it. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this could be bad. Really nothing we can do right now except for actually uh, avoid the laser beams of doom, death, and destruction, buddy. But yeah, this is actually pretty much my favorite boss fight in the entire game. Trust me, this this boss fight is actually pretty darn epic. <laughs> oh yay, hover bootings! Why must we need to hover boots? And hover booting! Yay! So yeah, that's basically all we do is we get on it and just try and stop from dying. Screw your laser beams of death, dude. I don't like them. Kind of already figured this as a myth. Well, actually, I have, but I don't know about you guys. <laughs> Enough of this dodging, weaving. Can't catch me now, can you? Alright, and that's basically all we have to do is dodge and then go ahead and pull this up. But that's not it. Trust me, guys. This is not... This this right here is not the reason why it's my favorite boss battle in the entire game. Oh, there's... It's just the entire thing. The thing in its entirety. Alright. Yay! I know he wants to kill me, but you know what? You can't. Ow! I was gonna say you can't touch me, but you can't touch this. Can't touch the lumbacks, buddy. Ah! Run away from the giant laser beam of doom! Yeah, there's really no place to be safe on this by standing around in one place. But, uh... Yeah, you just kind of have to go back and forth and all that. Yes, we know this, Azimuth. We've done this, what, this is the third time now? Hey, buddy. And somehow we actually get flung up here. Don't ask me how. Alright, come on, Azimuth, must move faster. Ah, quit hitting me. Quit hitting me. Don't hit me, you crazy freaking bastards of death. Eat Dynamo of Doom. Ow. No, we should not be friends. You should eat Dynamo and die. Can I kill you, please? Thank you. Oh, hey, Azimuth. How are you doing? Thank you for the assist there. Now come and grab me. Please. Um, Azimuth, come back here. Please, can I grab a hold of you and Come so we can actually go? Alright, thank you, Azimuth. Woo! 
Oh yay, now we actually get to go and do this. Like I said, this whole entire battle is one big huge boss battle and it's I love just how many different phases this guy has has to have to put you through. Um it, if you guys don't know my uh, thoughts on boss battles, the boss battles that actually sit and have make you think. Um now. You're doing great, Ratchet. Remember, reward over consequence. You can do this. You can do this. You all clear, General. I'm locking on now. Got it. And now, after all that, we can finally deal damage. That all that was was just foreplay to this just going around and uh, it's I don't know it's one of those things that you just have to alright you quit throwing your, your laser beams and eat dynamo and uh, crap I, I am going to freaking die if I am not careful Yay! Go Tesla coils! Um, um, no! Dad! I was so close at killing you on the first try. But at least it just puts us off right here and, well... Yeah, this guy, is. once you get to this stage, he's actually fairly quick to take out once we actually start dealing damage to him. All sorts of fun jazz! Stop hitting me, you crazy bastard, you! Can you die, please? Thank you! Thank you! Death to you! I think I already destroyed the turret and the core is already in the process of rupturing. Oh my goodness, we only have 20 seconds to get on to, to get on Azimuth's ship. Meh. Hover booting courses. Definitely good to go. Anyway, that actually took a little bit shorter than what I thought it would be. Uh, I'm debating. Should I just end the episode off here and just call it a short part and then. Because all it is from here on out is going around and clearing out the sector. Hmm. Which I'm. Which I kind of want to get a couple people to commentate on it. Co-commentate, anyway. Oh, well, we'll... Yeah, you know what? I'm going to call the part here. And I'll see you guys next time. Sorry about the short part, but... Eh, what do you, what do you got to do? Entire part with a boss fight. I'm setting a course for Planet Lumos. It's in the Corthos sector. Yeah, we're not going to be doing that in this part. Ah! <laughs> Sorry you had to go so long without another Lombax to talk to. If I'd known you were alive, I would have come for you. Just know that from this day forth, you have a family. Alright, cool. Anyway, so see you later, guys. Keep things frosty.